And our team coverage continues now in the South Bay, where we are watching both problems and concerns on this wet and windy Sunday morning. One of the biggest trouble spots is in San Jose, where the Guadalupe River is expected to flood later this morning, and some mandatory evacuations are underway. KTV's Amanda Quintana joining us live from San Jose with what's happening right now. Amanda? Yeah, well, we are right along the Guadalupe River on Alma Avenue, and that is where the city is telling people that it is expected to flood. They are trying to get people out of this area. Police said that they were uh, here. They had these specialized loudspeakers trying to tell people to get out of this area. So I want to give you a look at the water right now, because according to the National Weather Service, the river is expected to reach flood levels. They forecast that to happen at 6 this morning, and then they expect it to crest around 10 this morning, and that's at 11.4 feet. So you can take a look there. We are maybe barely at 9 feet here. But another thing that they do is they show you what was observed. So yesterday at around 10 in the morning, it was observed at 2.13 feet. So that just gives you an idea of how high this water um, has gotten just over the last 24 hours. So again, forecasted to crest later this morning here at the Guadalupe River. Uh, the city of San Jose did activate the emergency operations center yesterday to prepare for any impacts to this storm. The city has also issued that mandatory evacuation order because there are often encampments in the banks of the river and police officers were here trying to warn people that they, if they are in this area, their life is in danger. Now there are uh, places that people can go. So there's an evacuation center at Camden Community Center, and then there's an overnight warming shelter, and that's at Roosevelt Community Center. Uh, when we did get here this morning, there were some crews from the city, some cars here, just making sure that everyone is truly out of this area. Um, we have seen some people just kind of walk by wanting to see what the river looks like at this point. So people are definitely interested in this area, but police want to tell people to stay away from this area because they do expect it to flood sometime soon this morning. Live in San Jose, Amanda Quintana, KTVU Fox 2 News. Amanda, thank you. And the 